but this guy has a survival instinct and a knack for knowing when exactly to do it. Breaks the tackle, he's got room to run. He's at the 50, he's at the 30, 10, and all the way in. Touchdown, New York. Saquon Barkley, 71 yards. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. Well, if they didn't get the wake-up call before the game, they got it right now. Two plays already in the end zone. I think of it in boxing terms because whether it's a big shot with your first one or a probing one, a little bit of a jab, the second one was the payoff. That was the big one that landed. One, two, end zone. Saw over and over again in Barkley's rookie season. He had 91 catches last year, most ever by a rookie running back. Part of a fantastic rookie campaign that saw him go over 2,000 total yards. A big chunk of yardage there, 37 yards. And it is still early, just the first quarter. But you start prorating the numbers, and we might be in for some history. I mean, that last run puts him over 100 yards already, and we've still got three quarters to go. Into things. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. Shotgun now for Manning. He lets this one fly toward the... And that is caught. He's got it for a giant touchdown. Saquon Barkley with his second touchdown in this opening quarter. And the Giants have taken the lead. And man, Charles, talk about zinging something in there. Those gloves, they help with one-handed catchers. The fun stuff, any padding for a rocket like that? One would think so, but I'll guarantee you this. On the first down run. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven. Leaves him with a second and three. Gets this out to Saquon Barkley. Well, they're making an effort to get the ground game going tonight. So far, it's working. I like what we're seeing from the offensive line. They seem to have the leverage going, and they're controlling things and reestablishing the line of scrimmage, moving that defensive front backwards. But also like what the runner's giving us, too. It appears that he's been waiting all day long to get out here and take off. first down. Manning going to hand it off to Barkley. Still going. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. Saquon Barkley doing it again with his third touchdown here in the opening quarter as his guys are able to regain the lead. And a pair of rushing touchdowns now for him in the first quarter. And I'm liking what I'm seeing from his big guys up front because they're winning the leverage game. How many times have we talked about low man wins, right? Move the defensive front aside, create those gaps and holes. Running it with the NFL's Offensive Rookie of the Year a season ago, Saquon Barkley. A tremendous play there from Saquon Barkley. Give him 42 yards on the ground. Well, welcome to the party. First carry of the game. How about that? And just think, as far as he's concerned, he's just getting warmed up. Eight yards on the pickup, and now they'll have some options on second and short. Pretty effective run there. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. Scampering home from 19 yards out as his guys are on the board here in this first quarter. Well, go ahead and strap in, partner. We, <laughs> less than two minutes in, had the score on the one side. A quick answer, though, to get the equalizer. Sometimes you get that sense of urgency that ratchets up, right? When you give up an early touchdown like that, you just know you're like, okay, how do we go back and equalize things? Can we get it done fast? Marks in the receiving core. Of course, no OBJ. He's in Cleveland. But Sterling Shepard has a fractured thumb, though they think he'll be a go for the opener. They're hoping so. Corey Coleman won't, however, an ACL tear in training camp. He's done for the year and then Golden Tate recently lost an appeal so he has his match. Talk about a play that absolutely costs you in the end. Just trying to do your job, right? Trying to get him on the ground. Next thing you know, the march up. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. Saquon Barkley with his second touchdown in this opening quarter as they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. 
Well, he told us he was going to hit the end zone a couple times in this game. I just don't know that he envisioned doing it in the first quarter. He probably did. I'm not sure we, <laughs> we did, did yeah. right? Because all the great ones, that's what they do. They dream about it, right? They think about it. They envision it. They think it's going to happen and almost will themselves into it. On second down, here's Barkley. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. 12 yard. Working pretty well from them. And here's the best part. We always talk about the best performers do their job when the lights come on. I think he likes natural light best. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. 15 more there, and they're on a roll. It's a you to overcommit running in that direction. Then he cuts back up inside you into the middle of the field. That's what we just saw there for a nice pickup. Second and five now. Manning. Now he'll dump it underneath to his running back. Complete. And they're going to have another first down as he's going to be tackled at the Browns 16. On EA Sports. Giant football and we're ready to begin the second quarter. As they've got it with a first and ten. Manning to Barkley on the draw play. And they corral him just a couple yards shy of the end zone. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. And he continues to pile up the yardage. That puts him over a buck 50 now. And this defense has really had its problems trying to keep him contained. This will be caught at about the six. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. Saquon Barkley on his way to a monster game. Three first-half touchdowns. As they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. CD, it seemed like they were so focused on the guys out wide. This takes the field, and we turn our attention to Saquon Barkley. And Charles, you can't really fault him. He's over 100 yards already. He's not the reason they're losing. And that is really unusual because ordinarily, when you've set the tone this way and have run it this effectively, usually your team's in control. So it's a very strange situation. And you're right, you can't fault him. He's done a great job for his team thus far. I'm guessing he's saying, feed me on the sidelines. Now will they continue to do it? They keep it with Barkley on first down. Nifty footwork at the 45. A 14-yard pickup. That's 14 yards on two straight plays. And that's the big fella's M.O. right there. Running through tackles, keeping the sticks moving forward. In this defense, if you don't bring 11 guys to the ball to try and get him on the ground, he's going to keep making runs like that. I feel the press box shaking every time he touches the rock. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. Now it's Barkley. Oh, the spin. And some room to work. And now running right through it. Another strong gain on the last two plays. They've moved it a combined 33 yards. Would you say this offense is locked in right now? They're having no trouble on this drive. What is it, three plays, three first downs? Yeah, you talk about on the march. They keep this up, they'll get to that end zone real fast. First down carry for Barkley. He'll have a first down inside the 10. Another big hitter there. This one good for 18. Oh, he's got the full package. He can spin. He can juke. He can make you miss. He can drop a shoulder on you. Some of that elusiveness we saw at Penn State has definitely translated to the NFL game. Saquon Barkley hit the proper buttons and turned him loose. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. They'll try and run for it with Barkley. And he's going to ball his way into the end zone for a Giants touchdown. Saquon Barkley 
on his way to a historic performance, four first-half touchdowns. As they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. And let's not forget he had the receiving touchdown early. Goal position. Good starting field position for the New York Giants here as they come up first and ten. And he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. Touchdown, Giants. Saquon Barkley, 58 yards. As they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. Now you talk about the dominating rushing performances that you and I have seen together. This has got to be right up there. His fourth touchdown run of the game and another long one to boot. And I don't need to ask for a witness because you're down. They'll run with Barkley. And an alley to run. Oh, and now he bowls him over. Fourth down conversion plays. You usually think one, two, three yards, maybe ten. Not there. What a huge pickup as the sticks make a drastic shift forward. That's sort of a prime example, is it not, of, of selling out defensively on fourth and short? It certainly is because what you're doing defensively, is saying you're going to stop them right there at the line of scrimmage or make a play on the other side of the line of scrimmage. Instead, they get just enough of a hole chopped. On the way down at the 35. On the run, it's Barkley. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. set up the screen that's complete and he will take it on in for a giant touchdown Saquon Barkley in the final seconds of the first half as they are an extra point away now from tying this football game I don't think it's any state secret to know what they were saying before the start of this drive let's go and punch one in the end zone and go into the halftime feeling a heck of a lot better about ourselves. Let's go get this done. Yeah, tie things up, and then you get a brand-new ball game. 